John Singer and Spiros Antonopoulos walked to work together every day for 10 years. Antonopoulos got sick eventually. He started behaving unusually. For Singer, this was a time of great distress. Singer could no longer stand the rooms where Antonopoulos had lived, and he rented a place in a shambling boarding house, not far from the center of the town. Singer became the therapist of many. He provided company to those conflicted. However, he missed Antonopoulos. He wrote to him. My only friend. I stood before our home the other day. Other people live in it now. Do you remember the big oak tree? You remember the four people I told you about, right? They are all very busy people. I do not mean that they worked at their jobs all day and night, but that they have much business in their own minds always that does not let them rest. They come up to my room and talk to me until I do not understand how a person can open and shut his or her mouth so much without being weary. Words in their heart do not let them rest. I do not understand, so I read it to you because I think you will understand. It has been five months and twenty-one days now. All that time I have been alone without you. The only thing I can imagine is when I will be with you again. If I cannot come to you soon, I do not know what. <laughs> 